Hey, trains. So guys, we're back with another video. Casey's with me. Make sure to hit the subscribe button. Click that bell so you get the notifications. This is part of the $7,500 I spent. Actually, I scored in this one. The box slot cars were a little bit less than I thought they would be. But there's more locomotives on this one. So let's take a look. How many locomotives? A lot. 35. Okay, we're going to look at the cheap stuff first really quick. So just show it and then just stack it in this back shelf. Right here. So these are just cars. Most of these, we'll, we'll do quick on these. They go five to 10 bucks a piece. Obviously they're dusty. They've been in storage for like 35 years. We haven't cleaned these yet. What scale are these? These are all HO. HO? Oh, okay. Actually, this one looks a little bit small even, but no, it's HO. Yeah, isn't N the smallest? No, it is N scale, S scale. Oh, S scale's even smaller? Yeah. I'm pretty sure S scale is smaller. And that's probably different scales, but big ones are like N scale, HO scale, O scale, which is not that popular, G scale. I can't keep G scale stuff in stock when I get it. Oh, here's another locomotive, 36 locomotives. So yeah, we only thought there was like five to 10 locomotives in here and it ended up being 36 locomotives. So I got a nice little bonus on this one, but it's okay. I spent plenty of money. Oh, these are really interesting. They're different states. So there's a state of Georgia, this is a state yeah, of Yeah, they're cool, but they're common. This one is cool right here. This stuff is nice. Oh, wow, look at that. just wagons and stuff kind of doing quick so you get to see them part of me doesn't even want to film those to be honest but but i made them and she made me that's people that enjoyed us yeah because they said there's people who like choo-choo trains out there choo-choo trains yes okay sorry that's my mommy word <laughs> Like I said, most of these are like five to ten bucks a piece. There's a few that are a little bit better. Like this Virginia trucky one with the searchlight is probably fifteen bucks. These are cool. These are probably uh fifteen or twenty bucks. Bachmann's with missiles on them. Oh, check it out with the missiles. I like stuff like that. Yeah. The United States Air Force. We actually know somebody in real life who has stuff like that. Yeah. Circus car tanker. This is another one of these passenger cars right here, Concorde, which is a better brand. So this is twenty or thirty bucks. And then this one is nothing. So now locomotives. I'm not gonna pack them. Some of them. Um, let me see. So a lot of these locomotives, they're like you know thirty bucks to one hundred and twenty, depending what brands um and it really matters also what, the, what what railroad it is pennsylvania i'm just gonna keep them just put them forward for a second i'll just unpack them here's a presidential one no just move them away but oh i'm sorry you said move them no i'm just put, stack them up here and i just move them forward so they kind of come in a camera shot if somebody really likes something you know they can always hit pause on the video hear that if you really like something hit pause on the video <laughs> i think they know that they're, they're, they're all high quality youtubers okay. the rock oh the rock santa feast steam locomotive Union Pacific. You know, it would be fun if we went to... Um... And you can leave them all open, actually, because I need to price them anyway. Okay. So these all will be in the store next week. So they have Chessie Systems. In San Diego, they have a really amazing railroad museum. Do you think maybe we could go on a field trip on our YouTube channel? We only work... Actually, we can take them on a field trip. Is that a good idea? You know, I've been right? I think that would be fun. Showing off a little bit of San Diego love. Yeah. That would be fun. Burlington, this was a little rough. These are already the one you want to put them on. Oh, well, I like this one. I just, you know, I'm starting to really like green for some reason. Green for cash. Is that what it is? Southern Pacific black one. Jesse. Delaware Hudson. Now, I could these, do these a lot of slower, but I, you know, I want to try to show you guys a lot of stuff as fast, so keep it exciting. Get to see what we get. I mean, these are all engines. Like, I totally scored on this deal right here. 
Yeah, he thought there was only gonna be like three to five engines. Yeah, but you know what? Like I said, I, on the slot cars, we thought there was like 200 box slot cars, which only used to be 167, so. so it, it evens out. It evens out. And you know, me and Mark, where I bought this from, we've done so much business together throughout the years. And I'm sorry, gave, Mark and I. Mark and I. And we give each other a break, so it doesn't really matter as much. You know, sometimes he gets a better edge, sometimes I get a better edge, but you know, we go way back. We're yeah. family, basically. Renee calls it family. Mark calls it frenemies. Yeah, we are frenemies. <laughs> it's like we're really good friends, but we're enemies when it comes to the business sometimes. Yeah, they're big rivals, that's why. Yeah, but sometimes, and then we make deals. I mean, you know, he bought a $300 locker. And calls he made $7,500 off Renee. Yeah, and then, oh, you know, and yes, he could get more if he sells it all individually. But he has another 20 grand worth of stuff. <coughs> set up Pacific, that's a cool little setup. Oh, wow, this. they paid forty six forty, and that was old school before barcodes. <coughs> yeah, it's Bachman. I think the last we usually get like 70, 80 bucks for those. This is really nice. It's a big one. That's a pretty blue. Oh, well, that one just got marked on. Hey, just move some back. Amtrak. Running out of space, honey. You have too much merchandise. Stop buying. Stop buying. Hey, don't go to Disneyland. <laughs> I'm trying to open this tight go right here. So I kiss it all covered up. Oh, that's pretty. Oh, that's really nice. I don't want to take it out because there's no bottom one, John. It's called the Royal Blue. The Royal Blue. That's a nice set. Six thirty-eight. That should be at least fifty bucks. Ah! That's Casey Trump's. Every one of them. I did not. See, I make money and she just devalues it immediately. Here's another really big one. Southern Pacific. Said Mr. Clumsy. I'm not clumsy. Very clumsy. They said on storage was I'm the most efficient buyer. I never break anything. Actually, that's a huge lie. There was actually a joke going on because every excavation we go through, I usually end up stabbing myself or cutting myself somehow. I just get excited and I do stuff fast. Like a lot of times, like I just want to get stuff done and they're like, oh, you need to slow down, slow down. Great Northern. And the camera guys would tease me because I'm always like all over the place. And you know, the more I move, the more they have to move. And those guys are in better shape than me, but they also carry these heavy rigs, which I think can be 20, 30 pounds sometimes. And they do it all day long in that position. So I apologize to any of the guys, Paul, John, John. Uh, I just want brain dead. John, you guys all know who you are. So yeah. all the storage wars camera guys, Jeff, who else? There's so many of them. They're gonna get upset. You forgot I know, me. it's like, I'm gonna get emails. Well, you didn't mention me. What about Diego? Diego, yes, Diego's a camera guy now. Yeah. Started off as a PA. Look at how he moved up. Yeah, that's great about the film industry. You just keep on moving up. And for our last one, the Midnight Special Tico. Hit that subscribe button, smash the like button. Thank you for watching.